wait, there's been great effort. These guys have given us great effort all year. Uh, this is what we need to do in terms of completing that. I mean, this shows you exactly what we're capable of in SSF play. Because we have, those are the same guys. In fact, some of the different guys because of the injuries. Some of these young guys got more opportunities and did some great things. But, you know, we are capable of, of big things. And there's a good group of guys that, you know, that gave everything there, you know, that they had. And it was, uh, it was very gratifying because uh, they played for each other, which is probably the most important thing. And uh, I could be more proud of that group. You know, one of the things that I talked about was somebody coming up in these situations and making plays. And great pressure from the defensive line and Thomas Davis making a big interception. And then we get into the four minute offense and you know Chud calls the screen pass and it goes for a touchdown. I mean those are the things that we're capable of, those are the things that we need to do to finish games off, you know, and, and it just shows that we have the ability. It's taken us a while to come together and do those things. But uh, you know I, I think someone on the line would like to believe this on the point. Ryan, we were running out of bodies in the secondary. It looked like Campbell at one point was even having to tell Colin yes. uh, what plays to get. Very much so, and, and, and you know, kudos to, to, to DJ Campbell for being you know, a, a, a quick step. He's done a great job for us all year, and you know, he showed exactly uh, what he's capable of. He's a smart football player as well. Uh, did some really nice things. You know, we, we, we did some different things this week, um, and, and, and playing him you know, really gave us an opportunity in terms of getting guys lined up. Uh, it, was, it was a great effort by, by Colin, and you know, it, was, uh, it was really good to see, and uh, you know, we made we made a little bit more because of uh, the injury to Rookie. I mean, I, I'm not sure yet. I haven't talked to the other doctors yet, but uh, we'll see. Was this one single since September 30th? Oh, I'm sorry. Was this one single since September 30th? This game was one single since September 30th. So, um, well, <laughs> you know, um, all of our division games are circled. To be honest with you, you know, uh, they really have been. But this one, you know, th there was a little bit more to it, um, obviously because of the way we lost. You know, we went up there and played pretty darn well against a very good football team, and they came out on top. Uh, we came out today and all played against a, a very good football team. You know, this time we came out on top. And uh, I think that's probably the most gratifying thing about it is that we played it against a very good football team and beat them. Ron, can you talk about Kansas play? It was, it was spectacular. I mean, you know, Atlanta's a big game for him personally because, you know, it's his hometown team. And, he wants to play well. That's why the loss in Atlanta was so tough on him. He, he took it very personal, and, and I think it carried over for a little bit with him. Um, but with the way he played and things that he did, I mean, that shows you what he potentially is going to become. Um, he, you know, we just got to keep working him, and, and he's got to keep growing as a football player. These last what five weeks now have been, been pretty doggone solid, and, and I'm very pleased with his development. I think with Coach Hewlett. Should have been doing with him has been right on, and, and he's really um, accepting it and, and working it. You know, and plus the playmakers around him have been stepping up, you know, and, and so yeah. there's been a lot of good things. What did you see change in that last five weeks or so where Cam has? Well, I just think you know his 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 his, 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 his football acumen, you know, what he's learning as far as the game, and you know, I, I think his 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 footwork has gotten better. His his technical, um, his, his 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 technique, his style, things that he does, it just. You know, it's like it's all of a sudden the, the light bulb has gone off, and, and that's been, I think, that's been big. Coach, is a, and your opening drive was sort of remarkable in that there were never more than a third and short. You never lost yardage. You never had a penalty. And it was, a, a, I mean, a really cohesive drive to start the game. First drives aren't often the turning fast in. Do you think that was a little bit more important than most? Um, I just don't think the drive. I, I think then the way the defense came out and then got off the field immediately and got the ball back and kicked the field goal. Then we did it again. I mean, I, I think when when you can set the tempo and tone early on, uh, I think it's great. Our special teams were, were, were solid today too. I think you know with, with what those guys have done lately has, has been awesome. You know, we got a lot of good players that are out there giving their best. Um, you know, we got we elevated a young man, Armand Smith, and he stepped up and made a big play for us, and that was huge. And, and I'm, I'm pretty excited about you know uh, seeing these young play, young players play. Was the plan coming in to play Dockery as much as he did, or was that a set? Right? Um, that was, you know, we wanted to play him a little bit, and uh, we got him into the second half and, and just stayed with him, and, and uh, he played pretty good. You know, pretty excited. I mean, he's a young guy that, you know, is going to need reps, and we'll continue to work all our young guys and give all our guys an opportunity to play football as we go forward. Was it something that Norman did today? Well, I think it's, you know, we wanted to see uh, Dockery get in and, and be aggressive and uh, see how he could handle that. You know, and uh, I thought he did pretty good. You know, we'll watch the tape and we'll sign on those things. Ron, your, uh, your demeanor is calm. You, you're almost seen. 
great win as big as that, you know, to see them all that excited. I'm very excited. Believe me, I am. And I think the reason I'm calm is I'm very emotional about it. I gave a game ball today to Thomas Davis. I told the team that last spring, Thomas and I sat down with our owner, and we didn't know exactly where Thomas was. And Thomas looked me in the eye and told me he would come back. And I said, I'll give you the opportunity. Um, Thomas, I knew he really wanted to make it through both Atlanta games. And, uh, you know, as a, as a head coach, when you have a guy that looks you in the eye coming up three knee surgeries and, and, and he makes you believe in him, that's what it's all about. It really is. And I'm sorry. Thank you.